Welcome to this channel. Today I like to give you a tools, a tools that can check ourselves when we are taking educations in martial arts or sports. We need these tools so that we can really see where we are. As we all know, Xi Xiaodong has been there exposing fake traditional Chinese martial art for past four years or so. More and more people is uh, following that trend. Now, that is a reality why people follow him, because he speaks the truth. And still today, many in traditional Chinese martial art have never had an education and living in fantasy, disregard of what the uh, Xi Xiaodong said. You can see today people uh, practicing or learning a set or two, and then they start to create their own stuff. They call themselves Grandmaster, or they call themselves Sifu. So today I like to share with you these tools so that once for all you know where you stand. Now, as in my book, Wing Chun Inception, I share a model, a model which have the intelligent world and the natural world. So, let's put in the whiteboard. This is intelligent world where you spin your brain, your mind, your thinking, this is the natural world where you need to use your body and everything. So in the natural world, you have a depth, a depth, a deep, a depth of ability or skill. If you want to talk about martial arts, meaning one need to know how much development or how much skill one has in terms of momentum handling because fighting art is about momentum fighting art is based on momentum handling also the muscular endurance and cardiovascular endurance okay so in this natural world one have this, the depth of ability of handling momentum, the uh, muscular endurance and the cardiovascular endurance. Now you look at the MMA player, okay? Their training and their complete accomplishments or their skill is from somewhere in the intelligent world where they think they have the strategy and they develop this entire thing up to say point A, point B, point C. That's what MMA player develop or education in and develop and train in. Also like Western boxing doing that, wrestling doing that and also our friend Xi Xiaotong is doing this. So if one really want to get into combat, the bottom line is the father or the, the, the deep one get into this natural world. The higher the level or the skill of one. Okay? So, so this is the standard. How deep one get into the natural world developing or training their body, their momentum, their neuromuscular connectivity or synergy or proficiency. Oh yeah. Now, you look around in Chinese Kung Fu, people, the talker, the wannabe, is here spiraling their mind, like watching my video and thinking they are already uh, 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 expert. Oh, I know already. They are here. 
They have no idea on this world. Okay, they are here. And people here is were keeping me making movie, talking legend on Grandmaster or uh, story or whatever. Okay. So this is like the keyboard warrior. Okay. A fantasy talker. While you look at all kinds of people here who live here, once they get into in touch with Xi Xiaodong, the entire thing collapse. Same thing with here. Somebody might have some demonstrations or uh, some type of uh, 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 power in demonstrations and they are only here. They are not even get into the ability death of a usual MMA player. Just there. Okay? Doing one set, performing one set, showing this is Fa Jing. So you can see today Chinese Kung Fu mostly is here. And they have all title in the uh, Sifu or Grandmaster and all thing here. And you can see it come up so much. Uh, uh, theory and all kind of stuff while the MMA player like Xi Xiaodong and so forth for four years you look at him he's doing the same thing he's practicing the same thing they go through this okay now when you go through this it's like in the football coach football training or you running marathon training people need to have their clear mind do exactly what their coach do or their coach uh, 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 instruct them or correct them look at those uh, Olympic player be it in judo or running in swimming everything drill again and again in simple stuff until they get their momentum handle they improve their muscular endurance and cardio endurance okay there's no gimmick, no, no, no fantasy, no, no mysterious story there. Look at the Chinese Kung Fu people. How many is here? In here? And the worst thing, the disaster, the catastrophe of traditional Chinese martial is when people get here, it's like taking drugs. One not even be able to think clearly. So that's why, like I mentioned in my previous video, when I say Mike Tyson, somebody will say, oh, uh, I want to include this other uh, boxer too, or something like that. Or, you know, you're talking, fighting, uh, all kind of stuff. What fighting? If one have no idea on the momentum handling and the, the, uh, the, the muscular and cardiovascular conditioning and neuromuscular conditioning or the functional training like today's sport science, uh, sport science or sport men in Olympic athletes in Olympic, the, the MMA player. So, so this is the reality. It is this simple. One have never really trained, like here, they never develop their body, their handling of momentum. They don't know what it is. They do not know how to even think clearly when one get into here. So here is like, you join my group, my cult. Oh, I'm Grandmaster Hendrik. You join me. You brush your wing to me. And you practice this 1850 Shulin Tao set. And then you think you know everything. And then some even as ridiculous as just learn a little bit of 613.3 over here, not even be able to get here and start to create their own stuff. Isn't it so? So if one really want to develop one's Kung Fu, Chinese Kung Fu. One need to go through this. One first need to learn how to learn, to clear one's mind up, to see things clearly instead of 
like in the elementary school when the teacher say something in the math one once mine is outside outside there counting how many chickens is outside the window and thinking that they know math this is how serious it today this is why traditional Chinese martial art in past 100 years collapsed okay so today we have a model we know what it is as soon as you fall into this trap you can look at people who yeah you know you can look at people who even not be able to move their limb their hips and their knees over here and call themselves sifu are you kidding do you know how much the restaurant the restaurant yeah restaurant like high school restaurant restaurant train day in day out in the same si same simple move until one get it have to have a clear mind sharp mind so this is the thing this is the reality i mentioned this is because Two days ago, I mentioned the fastest ways to develop short strike Wing Chun. Yesterday, I gave an announcement, a, a warning that never ever change what I'm talking about. Because when one is here in this intelligent world, thinking, 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 have no idea why I am I'm, I'm, uh, designing for here, stop playing expert. And today I share with you this model. So, it is not about fighting, it is education. One need to know where one is, or else it is a disaster. It is just a snake oil selling and a corn man's job. And you put people into false security. It's like, if your body is not developed in here, are you going to tell me that oh I have this this technique that technique this using mine and so forth I can uh, uh, play self defense you give that to your daughter to your sister you think that you are helping them or you're screwing them when they have no idea on this because they trust you so that's why you need an education to know what what the heck is going on Playing gong ho here, fighting here is really different than the people who really train, well trained in the natural world. That's why who can stand up with Xi Xiaodong? You have a big China like this big. How many can stand up with Xi Xiaodong? That's a reality. So watch out. If you want to be good, watch out. Know this model. Don't stay here. This is a natural world where one rely on this, the, the real skill. Doesn't matter if it's a swimmer, if it's a gymnast, it's a runner. They all train here. They train hard. <clears throat> it is a boring, monotonous life. Like even the weightlifter. They do that every day. It's not sitting down here, drink, drinking tea <coughs> in some resort and talking, I'm using my mind, uh, not using my strength. Okay? If we miss this, we're going to get trapped here forever. And you know what is the consequence so this is what i like to share with you today you go here you have all the signs and everything to prove it to to verify like in in, in this book and the uh restricting wing chun even the ancient chinese go here and now we can have signs to prove it if you're stuck here, oh, I play this uh, uh, sets, this move, that move. 
one one serious thing today is people thinking about the hand techniques this hand techniques can do this that hand techniques can do that the chinese never say that it's just using our mind to think if somebody give me a punch a strike to the chest if i do not know how to move my body i can use all my techniques are you sure you can stop him you can have all your techniques are you sure you can stop him if mike tyson going to give a punch to me over here do you think i can stop him with my hand so what is my point my point is that if you know how to handle your body which is body method you just move away you don't even need your hand and the mike tyson punch will miss it but today people talk about this hand technique that hand technique hand, that hand techniques and then i do this i do this sense have no idea on this body so that's how how bad it is it is already here living in the fantasy here it's not here so you want to practice self-defense you need your body to handle when people come you know it's a tiger you run away you can have all your hand here standing there doing push hand and whatever for a thousand years if a tiger come you don't know how to move your body you're dead because it's a tiger it is not in the movie okay so it is the most ridiculous thing is talking about chinese kung fu have this hand technique that hand techniques this mind power that mind power the first thing is teaching how to handle this body and run and that come to this your momentum your muscular endurance uh, cardiovascular endurance okay the reality that's why Without this proper education, when anybody faces this, everything bent out of shape. Why? Because one have lost touch of reality. So this is to share with you. I'm here, I'm here not to scold on people. I'm here speaking loud because this is a deadly trap. If one do not have a clear mind, then one will trap here you think watching some video youtube or the the fight between mike tyson and and somebody or the the bruce lee's movie or uh, this uh, uh mma fight then you become expert then you can comment on this comment on this fight face it life is not like that those are movie entertainment the real thing here even you just look at how si xiao dong train look at how he trained look at how boring his training and how hard his training over here look at him when he's training that's where the people have the respect because they train hard they are here same thing with our mma friend our Western boxing friend, our swimmer friend, our football friends, they're here, not sitting down here. 